Valley Review. So in this Lead Valley Review, we'll go through the sales page, the demo of the product and the upsell. So I believe you will have a pretty good understanding of what this product is all about and whether it is worth investing your money in it or not. Okay, so it is launching today. Today is the 25th of August and it has been released by Joshia, Joshia Zamora. I'm sorry if I mispronounce his name. Well, let's get to the meaty part and let me take you to the sales page. We'll run through it first and then we'll compare it with the demo. And please stay with me till the end because this product does look uh, promising. I was even thinking of promoting it because it uh, I thought about it as like, okay, because they seem, um, well, they say it's, a, it's an app that would generate leads, targeted leads for you. And that's what it does precisely. But, you know, there are some issues with it and some issues issues like legal issues that you may not be aware of as well so it's it's pretty wise to be clued up when it comes to that and be aware of this before you even even start using a product like that so in short it's a lead app for you know not scraping because they they claim it's not a scraper they have the in built in built data so they have all of the data all of the emails inside of the system and they claim they would like update it on a regular basis as well um, okay sounds amazing right um, but as I said there will be some issues with it um, in my in my understanding and i have done quite a lot of research about this product i do not have the review access but i have done a lot of research and listened to a lot of objective reviewers that i respect highly who do have the review access and i can see through it okay i don't really need to have the review access in many many cases because it's just like you you gain the experience and you can tell um you know, between good and sort of not so good after some time. All right, so let's dig in. And also for those guys who wish to start making real money online, I always send those to a link below my review that will take you to a free offer that will set you on the right path of uh, la laying a foundation for a um, solid online business but we'll, i'll talk about it in greater detail at the end of this review okay as you can see we are on the sales page of uh, lead valley and they say well they say ready to grow your agency the smart way and leave and leave all the unreliable scrapers behind well it's not good it's not it's no good to use scrapers anyway guys so what they claim is that this is the revealed new done for you web app pr which provides instant access to millions of targeted buyers in any niche that are ready to pay uh, 500 to 1000 or more for your services. Okay, so what that is supposed to do for you is get you the leads Okay, and then you would obviously in the, in your niche, in whatever category you want, and then you would be offering your services to them, okay? So you'd get the contact details and you could, um, well, reach out to them and try and promote your services, sell your services to them. Okay, and they say also that so you can get more clients thanks to this app, uh, make more profit and dominate dominate any local area while your app provides you with all the leads you will you will ever need on a silver platter. Okay, sounds amazing, right? And and they like please. Um, uh, you may want to read through all of the features. You know, they, in short, they say that you know this is like not a scraping lead scraping tool, but they have all of the 
inbuilt data inside of this app and it's being updated regularly. So they are doing the heavy lifting for you. So it's not complicated to set up. Um, okay. You don't have to deal with the, you know, getting your IP uh, address blocked or having to pay the proxies and, 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 and so on and so forth. So you will never need to use the scraper ever again. Uh, what else do they say? And they say that, that this app comes with the most up-to-date, exclusive local business data that is not available to the public. Okay, well, you know, it sounds good, but the problem is like, as I have been doing my research and as I have been watching some reviews and of people who were really, really running this software through a um, test, proper test. So getting the, as you can see, this is the, the demo okay so you you input all of the information here all right he's showing in the demo um, the guy who the, the vendor what he's doing so you filter you uh, everything the information as you want it according to your niche you know is uh, the city you put in all of the information uh, like even if you want the people on Twitter, Facebook, so you can contact them via social media as well. So, you know, you're getting the email, LinkedIn, uh, and the, the address and even a phone number and the, and the name. And the, the problem was, okay, I could see that as that person, the person who was really running this product through a proper test, was checking the information, whether this is valid information or not. Okay, for example, there were like loads of disc uh, discre discrepancies. Um, this, the kind of discrepancies I'm talking about is like, when they went to check the, um, the leads, let's say, website, okay, the website, when they clicked on the website, the website wasn't um, existent anymore. It was dead. It was, I mean, it wasn't live. It was for sale. Okay. So the, the domain was not existent. It, the domain of that kind of, you know, what's the, what am I trying to say? <laughs> was not live. Okay. It was for sale. That's my point. And there were many leads of that kind. So they were out of business. Okay. And the way this app works is like you will be getting credits. So for every like, mm, the, you will have two options. I will run, f uh, go through the options later on. But for every one credit means one lead. So let's say, for example, you got 10 leads and that they're out of business. The, the website doesn't exist anymore. So you've lost your 10 credits for that. Okay. And that is unfortunately the case. Okay. I have seen it with my own eyes. Guys, you can still like, you know, get it, try it for yourself, but I am just warning you what I have found out, what I have learned about this product. Okay. And for example, like, um, there would be like, uh, the name would be, le let's say Francesca, or if you actually go to the website. Okay. Uh, for that specific lead on the website, say, it says that the owner is Anna. Or, or Catherine or whatever. You know what I mean? So like, um, it's misinformation and uh, it's not accurate information. And that is a problem because, you know, you would be assuming you're getting the correct data. But if that's not the case, that, you know, you'd end up being very, very frustrated because you would have to check every single lead one by one. And do you, I mean, will you, I mean, would you bother doing that? I mean, to me, that's a waste of time. So I did not like that. But, you know, here he's showing you in this demo how you would be doing this. And then you'd get the, like, okay, you could export the the email addresses. Um, what, is she, what is he showing now? That... Uh, he's talking about the credits that you like, yeah, one credit per lead. But as I said, you would be wasting a lot of credits for inaccurate data. And that is for me a big issue. Okay. It's quite a slow one. Now he's like exporting it. Okay. And here you have like this, like list of contacts. 
that you could potentially use for your business and try and reach out to them. Okay, but now the other big thing is guys, what reputable autoresponder would allow you to import contacts like that? Okay, who did not opt in and that that is not even legal because you did not get a permission from those people to contact them to get the email addresses. So there is a legal factor behind it that you need to take into, into consideration and be aware of it. It's, you know, it sounds all good, but you know, you could potentially get in trouble. So it's something just that you need to, again, take into consideration before even trying and using these sorts of leads. The best leads are, guys, that you would be generating um, with your own opt-in pages, okay? And learn how to do email marketing as well and learn how to get those email addresses from scratch. That's the best thing you can do, okay? Because you will be building a solid business like that. And I do have some amazing courses to offer you on that specifically and they're completely free. The link to it is below my review, but I'll get back to you on that later on. Now, this is the whole funnel, guys. And now let's just check the prices. I don't want to spend too much time on the sales page because they're like, you know, talking about all of the feature, how amazing it is. And, you know, I don't mean to be bashing the software. I mean, it's, I'm sure it's not like the worst, uh, like it's not a so-called shiny object. They don't promise you that you will be making so like some crazy money with it. It's, it's meant to be a tool that will generate those leads for you. And I don't have a problem with it, with it as such. But the problem I have is that, you know, I've seen it with my own eyes that, you know, some of the data is not, I mean, loads of the data, half of the data almost was not accurate. Okay. The name was not uh, the name of the person that was on the actual website or the domain was not non-existent anymore. So it is, it's a big deal and it, you know, it would end up, you would end up being very, very frustrated if you have to deal with it. Okay, but anyhow, they have j just like these two options. So the first one is a front end is called light. The other one is called agency. So the, the, the difference is in price is only $2. So the light one is $32.95. The other one is $34. 95 is just a marketing trick to get you to it's just two dollars more to get you and um, to buy the well the more expensive one obviously but uh, yeah the difference is in in the um, what in the credits mainly yeah so with the light one you you get only uh, 750 credits so that's 700 750 leads because one credit is one lead but again bear in mind that you know if you would be getting inaccurate leads or incorrect information you're still wasting your credits even though the lead is not uh it's out of business or whatever. Okay. So that's the, that's the big downside of it. But with the other one, you're getting 2,500 credits. And again, the, the difference is in price is only $2. Okay. So, uh, and then I wanted to show you the whole funnel. So the front end, um, let's say 34.95. Okay. But again, you have two options. And then there is this OTO number one when you'd with a $1 uh, with the trial for $1. I was not able to find out for how long this trial lasts, but then you would probably like, obviously you'd be getting access to way more like data, more leads for $47 a month. And then the OTO number two, 197 lead valley expansion pack and international pack i was not able to find out to like what exactly this is all about and then the 37 lead magnets today it's like a, a software for video editing it's quite a cool software actually this one i must say i i, I do remember reviewing this one and i 
did like the software. So you may want to check out the software on its own. Uh, I did review it some time ago. And then 47 OT number 3 instant outreach system. Okay, so this is the whole funnel, guys. And then, yes, I'm pretty much done with the review. There's not, not much to show inside of the members area. You just have this like my database. You will have some training, some videos. There were like free videos from what I remember. You set up your account. Uh, you can view your history here and the account um, export. So that's w where you'd be keeping the leads, I guess. Then again, the problem is like when you try and import that into your autoresponder, loads of like reputable autoresponders would not accept leads of that kind. Okay. The leads that not opt in. Okay. That didn't go through the whole like legal process. And again, at the end of the day, you don't have the permission to use to contact, contact those people because they did not opt in. Okay. So simple as that. Now, okay, guys, if you want to start like making real money online and learn about affiliate marketing, for example, about traffic generation and about email marketing the proper way, I would highly, highly, highly recommend you to check out these like free professional courses, guys, that are called lazy commissions on affiliate marketing and making reviews and then traffic end game on how to generate traffic and how to generate the leads the right the correct proper way and then last but not least email marketing secrets which is all about how to well mastering the secrets of email marketing and how to actually hit your clients inbox instead of like your emails ending up ending up sorry, ending up in the junk box and never be read by your clients, your prospects. So, you know, with these courses, which are free, totally free, you just click on the link, on the links here and you just simply, simply sign up. Okay, guys, if you need to reach out to me as well, you can, you have various ways of contacting me or you can if you have any questions with regards to these courses, I've got all of them. I've gone through all of them. I've, you know, like, that's why, like, I wholeheartedly recommend them. I got the reseller rights for them uh, because I love them so much. And this is my offer now. And I give it away for free for all of my viewers who are serious about starting uh, a legit solid online business and are, not, and are not afraid to put in the work and consistency. All right. Okay. So let me get back to you. And now my final thoughts on Lead Ballet is, you know, it may sound like a cool software lead generation software who doesn't want more leads okay and they promise it's not scraping it's like it's being um, updated regularly that it's inbuilt this data but i've seen it with my own eyes that there is a lot of discrepancies that the information is inaccurate you would be wasting your credits for leads that are out of business do not exist anymore and another big factor or big issue with this uh, method for me is that you know legally you could be in trouble because you don't have uh, the permission of those people to even contact them because they did not opt in well that's that that's um that's my final thoughts and you know if you still want to try it out guys you may but you will have to get it from someone else as I do not want to promote this product, I don't have the faith in this method. And yeah, I guess there are way better ways of making money online and doing it the right way without thinking that there is something like rich, quick, uh, fast and all of that nonsense, right? Okay, for those who have the patience to do it the right way and the right mindset, check out my courses free courses that I give away to all of my viewers for free. All right. Love you and leave you. And I shall see you in my next video. Take care. Have a beautiful day.